Good morning. Thanks for joining me at Coffee with Corey. I am so excited to visit with you today. It's going to be a little bit of a different episode this morning. Um, and it all started when I got a message after our last episode about what is your favorite book? And uh, it's, it's not close. This book um, is so important to me. It's been so important to my business and to my life. Uh, the Go-Giver is the name of the book. And uh, it was given to me by one of my very best friends in life. And uh, he's given me a handful of books through the years. Um, but this is probably the only one where I got the book. Um, I, I started reading it, couldn't put it down. I read it in probably an hour and a half and uh, sent him a message right afterwards. I'm like, we gotta get together and talk about the concepts in this book. Um, I, I thought I'd read the, uh, the uh, note that he put in and it says, Corey, this book has served me well. I hope you enjoy it too. Thank you for your friendship. And uh, I'll tell you, that's largely what this book is about. It's about uh, friends and just people that aren't even friends yet helping each other out with some simple concepts that uh, can really change your life. And uh, so I thought today, rather than uh, addressing real estate related questions like I've done with all the other episodes, I'd touch on a few of the concepts in this book. Um, the the uh, book calls them the five laws of stratospheric success. And um, I think we can put uh, law number one into practice today um, just by this, uh, this little episode of Coffee with Corey. The first law of stratospheric success is the law of value that says, your true worth is determined by how much more you give in value than you take in payment. I'd love to put that into practice today. If you would go to my business page, share this episode of Coffee with Corey, and then send a direct message to me to make sure I have your address, I'll make sure that you get a copy of this book. I think you'll enjoy it as much as I did and uh, hopefully you'll have read it by the next time we have coffee together and um, we can get some dialogue going about it. Thanks a lot, we'll see you next time.